this malarkey. Oh, he's making such a fuss, these celebs. Oh, they're not like you or me. Ah, ah apart from you, Jock. <laughs> Would you go and get him one of his favorite pizzas? No. Well, then I don't know what to do with him. I mean, he hasn't eaten for a few days. You've kidnapped a major movie star, okay? Now, you can either leave him somewhere and hope he's been sufficiently scared shitless to stay quiet, or you can send him on the kind of trip he won't come back from. Oh, a trip! Such fun! Oh dear, oh dear, what a palaver this is! Decisions, decisions! If you could just handle this, Jock... Mm. Al is in the boot of the car. You'd be doing us such a favor. I'm really not one for goodbyes. you from A to B. Uh, a being the trunk of this car and B being a horrific scenario of my choosing. Oh God, please no! I, I, I have money on me. Lots of money. Good to know, well, good to know. I'll be sure to grab that after we're done. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Please let me go. I thought you were a big tough action movie guy. See, you can act! Don't listen to all those movie critics! Are those crazy old bricks with you? Just me and you, honey bun! Did you have fun with those two? They're harmless, aren't they? They are not harmless! Those fucked up parlor games, the things that woman may be due to her feet! Ah, you lucky boy! Older women are to be cherished! Like a fine cheese! Sometimes the rind is the best bit! What do you want? Cars? Drugs? We're on art. I, I got shitloads of art. I know you wouldn't want that. Fuck! You barely know me, Al, and you're already judging my cultural standing. I find that very offensive. than a cheeseburger, a cold beer, and you shutting the hell up? I'm all good. Whatever they're paying you, I'll double it. They're not paying me anything. Then why are you doing this? Well, one, I'm a bad person. Two, I understand that love takes many forms. And three, most importantly, you've seen all our faces. I've made the mistake of not tying up loose ends once before. I won't tell a show, I promise. We both know you'll go straight to the police. I won't. I fucking swear it. I could give you ten thousand dollars right now. Well, here we are, Al. Curtains up. It's time for your final scene. No! You fucking psycho! Oh! What are you doing? Jock, we've been worried sick. I regret to report the sad passing of Mr. L. Danopoli. Train accident. Very sudden. I loved that man. We will remember him always. The way he was on TV, before we met him. 
Not that any of us met him, of course. You two enjoy the rest of your vacation. <laughs>